This is the 13th video of the WordPress Speed Optimization 101 course. In this video, I'll show you how to offload Google Fonts and make the website load fast. In the previous videos, we discussed how fonts play a crucial role in the LCP, FCP, and CLS metrics. There are pros and cons for using Google Fonts. Benefits of using Google Fonts. You can display professional-looking font styles on your website. There is a downside when you use Google Fonts on your website. Google Fonts can negatively impact core web vital metrics, and that is page speed and page stability, and can cause other issues, such as flash of unstyled content and flash of invisible content. On this website, I added two Google Fonts. One is for the title, and another is for the paragraph. I performed a GT metrics and page speed insights test. Let me click on the waterfall tab. Now click on CSS. As we can see, here is a style sheet loading from the Google server. Now let me click on fonts. Here we can see two fonts, and these are loading from the Google server. Now let's look at the page speed insights results. The mobile score is 87, if you don't know how to use the page speed insights tool. I have a detailed video in the WordPress Speed Optimization 101 course. In the course, I have shown how to use the Page Speed Insights tool and understand the issues. Before we continue the video, let me share some of the most valuable resources with you. If you want to speed up your slow loading website for free, I have a couple of solutions. I'm offering WordPress Speed Optimization 101 course for free. The course contains plenty of videos that will help you speed up your website. You can join our dedicated community for free. Post your questions and I'll do my best to assist you. Finally, you can visit our website, click on audits, and in the form if you provide the required information, I will audit your website, highlight the issues that need to be fixed, and provide solutions. All right, back to the video topic. Let me scroll down and under diagnostics. The first issue is eliminate render blocking resources. And as we can see, there is a style sheet loading from the Google server. Note, every external request will add up to the page speed. Next is the largest contentful paint. Let me click on this image, as we can see. The largest contentful paint element is a text block, and this is a font loading from the Google server. The duration for the element to display is 2730 milliseconds. Next, avoid chaining critical requests. As we can see, two requests are coming from external domains. Always try to keep the requests low, as the requests will impact the website's overall performance. If possible, avoid loading assets from external requests. Let's go back to the WordPress admin dashboard. We can go to the theme or page builder settings and set all the fonts to default. And there is another way to offload Google Fonts. That is by installing a lightweight plugin. Hover over plugins and click on add new plugin. In the search form, enter flying fonts. And here is the flying fonts plugin. Click on install now and then click on activate. The plugin is activated successfully. This plugin doesn't have any settings and now we have successfully offloaded the Google fonts. Now let's go to the front end of the website and refresh the page as we can see. Now instead of loading Google fonts, we are loading system fonts. Let me perform another page speed insights test. Wow. Before offloading Google fonts, the mobile score was 87. And after offloading Google Fonts, the mobile score increased to 98. Let me click on Eliminate Render Blocking Resources. As we can see, the request coming from the Google server is gone. Let's see how much time we save by offloading Google Fonts. When the request came from Google, it took 750 milliseconds to load. If you observe, this is the smallest file compared to all the requests here. Despite being a small file, it is the one that took the maximum time to load. Next is avoid chaining critical requests. As we can see, there are seven chaining requests listed here. Now let's see after results. Here we are seeing only five chaining requests as two Google font files are offloaded. Next is the largest contentful paint when the font files were loading from Google. It took 2730 milliseconds to load. Now let's see after results. Let me scroll down and here is the largest contentful paint element. As we can see here, the largest contentful paint element issue is fixed. Now it's taking 1,500 milliseconds to load, which is almost half the time compared to the results before. Note, just because you see the largest contentful paint element here doesn't mean it needs to be fixed. If you only see a red warning triangle or an amber informational square, you need to address the issue. I'm happy with these results. 
If you face any issues, post them on our community and I'll do my best to assist you. Speed optimization is a complex topic and there is more to learn. If you want to level up your speed optimization skills and build a career as a speed optimization expert, I have a solution for you. If you want to learn how to optimize a website efficiently, the ultimate speed optimization course is for you. Speed up your website, pass core web vitals and increase your business growth. This course is suitable for complete beginners, intermediates and advanced users. Here is a website that scored 16 on PageSpeed Insights and took 29.2 seconds to load. In just a few hours, the website scored a perfect 100 and loaded in just 174 milliseconds. Become a speed optimization expert and expand your portfolio. You are not just learning how to optimize websites. In the 100K Web Agency Mastery course, I'll show you how to find high paying clients, generate recurring revenue, etc. If you're wondering how much I charge for optimizing a website, the pricing starts at $500, which can go up to $30,000. I want to see you charge the same to your clients. By the end of this course, I want clients to search for you and not the other way around. The first 300 people who join the Ultimate Speed Optimization course will get a 100K Web Agency Mastery course worth $497 for free. Course links are in the video description and in the pinned comment area. Thank you for watching. If you want to see more such videos, like the video, leave a comment, subscribe to our channel and share the video with others. Sharing the video with others will help me get more views and motivate me to create more valuable videos to help you and others. We appreciate your support and look forward to having you in our community. I'll be back with another video soon. Till then, take care. Bye.